you guys are looking for some cheap FIFA 20 coins, head over to u7buy.com. You can buy coins off the website. You can also buy players. So if you wanted Messi, you could buy him off the website. Make sure to use code MUZ at checkout for Fab. Oh, that was scary to pick up. I kind of didn't want to buy that. I wanted to try and get a better price, but I've been trying to snipe this for so long. So screw it. We'll take it for like 4K less or whatever. So in terms of this card, boys, honestly, I've used his normal card, 79 rated. I used it loads at the start of the game. And he was hands down one of my favorite players. He was actually so solid. One of the best right backs I've used. A lot of the reasons for that is because of his work rates. His work rates, he's always back, which is sick. And obviously very fast and stuff. So in terms of this card, I imagine he will be absolutely outrageous. You could change him to centre-back in game. You could also change him into midfield, maybe. He has got a two-star weak foot, though, which is a bit of an issue. So as a right-back, though, I'll just play him as a right-back. But keep in mind that you could play him at centre-back for obvious reasons. And uh, yeah, so jumping into his actual card, six foot, medium high, right-footed, four-star skill moves. Wow, absolutely rapid. I don't think he needs any more pace than that. Um, passing's very nice. Dribbling's very nice for a right back as well. I like a, 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 a right back with like good dribbling. Um, and defending and physicals are really nice as well. Honestly, in terms of chem styles, I, the thing with a lot of these team the seasons is it's hard to know what to boost. Like I was saying on one of my other team the season reviews, I've done quite a few by the way, boys, if you want to check them out. Um, but literally just leave a basic on, on, on a lot of them. Especially midfielders, but in terms of actual these, so he's currently coming in at 416 on PS4, like just under 400, and then 420 on PC, which is a pretty good price. I don't know if he's going to drop. I'm not the best with reading the market, not with like fresh cards anyway. See, look, everyone's just sort of like guessing, a bit of an anchor, Sentinel. Sentinel might be a shout, you know, or a backbone actually. A backbone makes him a 95 um, thingy. Do you know what a backbone? Low key. A backbone might be the player, boys. Because long passing long passing's important for a, a right back for them line balls. I didn't realise his long passing was that bad. Bro, powerhouse, where's powerhouse? You know what? Powerhouse might actually be the player. If I can find it. Powerhouse. Powerhouse. Honestly, boys, like I know it seems a bit weird because of his defending. Like It's a bit of a waste on his defending, but he needs that long passing boost. I didn't even realise his long passing was that bad. I can't tell you how important it is to have a right back that can long pass like just down the line, like the through balls and stuff. It's mad important. So I'd go over a powerhouse unless there's another one that could that really boost passing. Um, maybe an artist. An a Hello? Artist. Did, did anyone recommend an artist? 3% of people, them 3%, 800 IQ, maybe 900, tops up his dribbling, tops up that, that plus 15 long passing, yeah, love to see that, boys, um, anyway, boys, hopefully you guys do enjoy, if you could drop a like, I'd appreciate that, drop up if you're new, I'm trying to be as quiet as possible, apologies if you can barely hear me, um, I'll try and turn the audio up, um, it's just my neighbours are sleeping in the garden, so I've got to be quiet, so, anyway, hopefully you guys enjoy. I'll try my right back and uh, honestly, okay, we've got a 3 a.m. sweat. Brilliant. Bit of a sweaty tip. Not the sweatiest of teams. He has got Gattuso, who is absolutely abysmal. He's about as good as a 76 rated non rare. Um, but anyway, I'm trying to right back. I'm going to play a 4 2 3 1 and uh, yeah, let's see how he does. The win back early. He has got white boots with a blue sole, boys. The blue sole. I've never seen boots like this. Okay. I definitely didn't pass that down the line. Beautiful from Haji. It's Hazard to make it 1-0. That's my bad. This guy's got team this season. Wambasaka. His first tackle back. Let's go, bro. He's getting bodied by a towel, though. What? How is he getting bodied by a towel? Right, let's see how he feels on the ball. I've not had much of a chance to play with him yet. Damn, he feels fast. Against Adama. And that's his ball. There is Wambasaka. Does have four soft skill moves as well, by the way. So he can do La Croqueta and, uh, and Magidi spins. 
beautiful. Here's Haji to make it one. It's always Haji. I was saying this in, in one of my videos. Like, Haji does not miss. He does not miss. The only way he misses is if EA turn up, EA Studio turn up, and they put a shot error on me. Um, I believe in coding, uh, if you don't know. I believe in coding. I believe the second you hit a certain amount of shots and, and a certain amount of possession, your shot error and your pass error increases. Um, that's why I believe. So, the second that kicks in, Hadji misses, and we've got to quit. So, first thoughts on Wambasaka though, he feels decent. I've not had many chances to actually use him, so we'll go jump into another game and we'll see how he does. Okay, boys, in to game number two. Let's see how Mr. Wambasaka does. Hazard with a tackle back early. Wambasaka, you can feel his pace, boys. The acceleration behind his behind his runs. Wambasaka with another tackle back, that's a bit of a lucky thing. Here's, here's his acceleration, watch his recovery speed. Honestly, rapid. And I'm 1-0 uh, down, brilliant. Wambasaka with that beautiful tackle back, let's go man. The age is insane right now, man. There's Mares. Mares to make it 1-1! Mares with that left stick dribbling. Boys, the responsiveness. It is 3 a.m. on a Saturday. 3 a.m. Who is awake? And the servers are so bad. Wambasaka. Turns really nice, by the way, boys. Wambasaka. The artist. The artist. He wouldn't have been able to make that on his on his basic. That's so bad from me. Wambasaka hit him. Wambasaka's won every tackle so far. My guy. That was definitely not a fake shot. Wambasaka again. Fourth tackle back. Basaka. Beat him, lad. Okay. Into Maris. To make it two. I shot that instantly. That's how unresponsive this gameplay is right now. Insanity. Um, but, yo. Wambasaka feels sick in the build-up attack. And uh, in the build-up attack, in the build-up play, what the hell am I about? And he's won the ball back every time so far. So honestly, boys, I'm liking him. Another quit. Okay, boys. So there we do have it. The Wambasaka review is done. And honestly, I th honestly, I think this guy might be better as a centre back. And the reason why I'm saying this is because because he's six foot. Well, saying that, I don't know. He he could do centre back and right back equally as good. I think. Um, he does feel decent. He don't feel insanely agile for a right back. Like when you use Semedo, he feels so nice, man. Um, and I don't know about you boys. I like to use my fullbacks in the attack. I do have to stay back while attacking, but a lot of my play comes like down the wing, like playing down the wing and stuff. Um, and like I said, that them long passing is is huge. So but yeah, hundred percent is worth it, boys. I don't know if it's gonna come down in price. 400k is a lot for this card and do i think he's worth 400k like f i don't know it depends on how rich you are really like 400k for a right back is ridiculous and i definitely if i had let's say i had three mil if i had three mil would i get this card i probably wouldn't i probably wouldn't because let me quickly go and have a look in fact we'll look on footbin let's have a look on footbin so cancello how much is the foot birthday cancello He's 200k, so it depends what Wambasaka's price drops down to. Um, I do the thing I love about Wambasaka is his work rate. So that's the one thing. Like he's got high medium, um, but I do love Wambasaka's work rate. So that's one thing. But at the same time, Cancelo has five star, four star as well. Um, and if you do tell tell Cancelo to stay back, then he will stay back. So do I think Wambasaka's worth 400k? Kind of no. Do I think any right backs worth 400k? Not really. I don't know if you boys agree with that. Um, I don't think he's he's worth 400k, but he is solid though, boys. Like every tackle he, he went in for, he won. You can feel, you can feel his aggression. Like every every um, tackle he went into, like he didn't go in half-hearted. He went in. Um, and yeah, what a solid card. So I recommend him, boys. And like I said, as a centre back as well, give him a tryout, and uh, it'll be an interesting card. So. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed anyway. If you could drop a like, I'd appreciate that. Drop a sub if you're new. If you'd like me to review any other players, do let me know. And uh, yeah, boys, 
I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.